welcome back <laughs> so today I'm doing another swatch party you guys I'm gonna do this one a little bit differently because I'm really not gonna talk a lot through the video while I'm swatching and all that good stuff I really just want to show you guys what the ColourPop press powder shadows that I purchased look like so if you're kind of wondering what some of them look like in real true to life live swatch form before you purchase them then you can check out some of the ones that I bought so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just be off to the side a little I'm gonna go ahead and do swatches I'll probably do I don't know maybe about six each because as you can see this is what my palette looks like this is the larger palette that they have and it holds 24 shadows so these are the ones I'm going to be swatching today I have one that is full of shimmers and one that is full of mattes so I think I'm gonna start out with all of the matte shades that I purchased and I'm just gonna go across each row so I'll probably be either doing six or if I find I can fit 12, then I will do 12 on my arm. But that's what I'm going to do. Just go across each row, swatch them. I'm going to list the names of the shadows aligned over here somewhere. And that way you can just relax, listen to some music, have a little drink or something while you watch how the colors swatch and see which names they are. So that's how I'm going to do this swatch party. Hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully it's relaxing. And hopefully it'll help you make a decision on whether or not you want to purchase some of these ColourPop pressed shadows. So let's go ahead and just jump right into the swatch. <music>
swatches, you guys, of my matte ColourPop press shadows as well as my shimmer and satin ColourPop press shadows that I decided to choose from my palettes. Now, first off, I will say that the shimmers, I think, are gorgeous. They're absolutely amazing, beautiful. They swatch gorgeously. And the duo chromes that they have are absolutely amazing. So I'm really excited to play around with a lot of my duo chromes. Now, the mattes, they didn't swatch the best. <laughs> they did not swatch the best. Um, the darker ones did swatch a lot better than the lighter mattes, but all in all just I've only used my shadows once to create this pink look that I have on right now and I must say I'm perfectly fine with the quality of these shadows and I think for I think they're like a dollar 98 or something like that when they're on sale when they're on sale <laughs> it's definitely worth it because you can create some really gorgeous looks with different shades that you want to pick you don't have to pick a whole palette full a lot of people already have their own magnetic palette so it might be a specific color that you're looking for that you want to pick up or you might really like some of these duochrome shimmers to add to your collection so I will say although the mattes didn't swatch as nicely as the shimmers they are still decently pigmented they can be a little dusty a little powdery but if you are familiar with ColourPop shadows and you know how to work them it's definitely worth it now when they're not on sale they're four dollars each personally i wouldn't pay four dollars for these shadows <laughs> but that's only because i know you know that they can go on sale and if i wanted to spend four dollars for a shadow it would be probably another brand that's of nicer quality that has their shadows on sale for four dollars so otherwise I think it's a pretty good deal you guys I really like them I can't wait to play around in all these different colors so anyway that's it you guys thank you so much for hanging out with me and I will see you on my next video toodles